so available. I love the design, it's 118 and change. Four flexible payments uh, are available, and again, our extended return policy. So that's coming up momentarily as well. 730244 is your item number if you'd like to order it. And Jay will continue the story, obviously, about that other amazing necklace as well in this next hour. So without further ado, shall I head over this way? I think, am I going over this way? Yeah, let's go over this way. Jay and I are with you for one more hour. We, uh, we've had a, a, a huge day with Jay today, a very special day as we celebrate Gemfest and 25 years of Jay King. Uh, but first we start with something that you have not seen before. Safe for us, brand new. You know, whenever you see a Jay King show, you're always gonna talk about turquoise because it's where Jay started. It is at the heart and soul of the Jay King brand, right? So when we talk about new turquoises, when we talk about uh, launches of turquoises, it's always exciting. In the last hour, we, we discussed Jay's private collection. Well, we are making a return visit to Jay's private collection. We're doing an intervention. We, we're, we're, moving through, <laughs> we're, we're moving through all of Jay's pieces. He's been holding them for years. It's time to let them go, Jay. And this is, you know, it, it, you know that does, that, I guess that's true. <laughs> <laughs> the Lord knows I need an intervention. I mean, you know, and I do hoard. I do hoard. I, you know, like, I, I think you got to tell on yourself because then when other people tell on you, you they can't do anything to you because you're not embarrassed because you told on yourself. There it you is. You know what I mean? The secret so I always learn to tell on myself before anybody else. Um, that, that's why Sheila always finds it hard because I always tell on myself So because I know that when she gets upset, she's going to tell on me anyway. You know what I mean? No escape. So, um, <laughs> the, um, this is Alicia Turquoise, and this comes from Mexico, and it comes out of what they, it's the Alicia deposit. They call it the tunnel mines. Um, this material, you just don't see it. Um, you know, this was, this was mined, oh my gosh, at least 10 years ago, maybe even longer than wow. that. Um, I didn't ever really get a lot of the material in the first place, and I only kept what what I did for my my private collection. I kept the best to the best, and this is it's got the this is all natural. This is the color. Isn't this this is these are out of my specimen case. Isn't this unique? Isn't that a very different color for a turquoise? Amazing. That's all natural turquoise. Here's the rough. Now you have to understand this is a specimen here, so it's a big piece. Yeah. All I did with this is I've cut it. Do you see the beautiful color? Here's some of the, that I did the eggs. These are actually in my specimen case. Wow. That, you know, the uh, specimens that I've kept of all the different turquoises and, well, everything. I mean, not just turquoise. I have, I have almost every material I've ever worked with. Right. Um, not all of them. I mean, I, in fact, I, that's another thing. I'm gonna have to build bigger specimen <laughs> cases. <laughs> I mean, it, right now it's out of control huge, but I'm running out of room. I'm now putting things in boxes, which is not good. Um, but this is Alicia Turquoise. This hasn't been color enhanced, color treated. If you like to collect the different kinds of turquoises, and you know what is really exciting to me? In uh, December, uh, two years ago, in 2018, we had that, uh, we launched that Hubei necklace. Yes. And we, we got that Hubei. And people, um, we did a, the, the month of December, we did this huge thing. People sent me pictures of their turquoise collections, mm. you know, things that they had collected. It brought back so many memories of materials and it really brought home, drove home the point that I'm trying to make now is they had pieces in their collection that I had forgot that we even worked with that material at that wow. time. It's the only, only uh, material that I have still is in my specimen case. I mean, I don't even have any of the turquoise rough anymore to make it. I love these designs. These are brand new, exclusive, very contemporary. Um, if you check out the beads on the necklace, do you love this or not? If you don't love it, don't, don't say you do. But I just love this new look. I really like it. It's just so contemporary, so modern. You see these beads that we did here? It's kind of like a cylinder rondelle, right? It they're, is. They're it like is. cylinder rondelle beads. But um, they're... They're, they're not really a fat tire, what we call a fat tire. They're like a cylinder, but we still rounded the ends. Yeah. And so they pivot, they wear beautifully. 
Jay, I love it. I do, I do love it. Um, the color is really special and unique. Thank you for your orders. The ring is in sizes five through 12, but nine, 10, 11, and 12 are now getting limited. The necklace, very popular this evening if you'd like to order. Okay, I'm gonna switch over just a little bit. Uh, there's some brilliant things coming up, including the launch of, Jay, is it golden? Am I getting confused? Is it golden mane, that other necklace? This is lion's mane. Lion's precious. mane. Ethiopian opal. It, it's about 15 minutes away. It's, oh my gosh. So there's some really good things coming up, um, but we have to go here. Uh, behind the scenes, when our wonderful team were putting this show together with Jay's team, they always like to obviously, you know, shine a spotlight on certain pieces. And one of those pieces is this. If you can, you should buy this necklace because this is a just a roaring example of uh, lapis at its very finest, lapis that you want, that you crave, that you desire, that you know money should be spent on, but at a price that does not match the product. I don't think you could readily find lapis that we're gonna show you for $118.70. This has been on pre-sale all day. Over 25% of the quantity was already reserved. Um, there's a lot to get to, so we'll get into why Lapis is special, maybe today more than it has ever been. We'll talk about the differences and how this looks like a midnight sky. We'll certainly share with you that this design seems to really resonate with everybody because it's the beads strung in an alternating pattern and graduating in size. Lapis is something you should own. And Jay, let's be honest, how often do you see lapis of this size and style and quality at a smidgen over a hundred dollars? Well, what's so crazy with, about this? Okay, this is brand new, it's exclusive. I designed this, um, you know, I don't, you know, I, I've told this story, so for the people um, that have already heard it, okay, you, you know what I'm gonna say, but what's happened with the lapis world in this grade mm -hmm. of material, it just doesn't exist. Right. We're, I'm not getting, I didn't, I didn't get any, I went on three, uh, what I call destination trips where I actually went to where we pick and I got zero. I went on a fourth trip uh, just to go look at something that somebody had in their yard that, that they said that it was what I wanted. <laughs> but when I got there, of course it uh -uh. wasn't. So I traveled a long way uh, for nothing. Um, I'm just not able to get this. Can I get lapis? I, I, I know where there's literally tens of thousands of tons, tens of thousands of tons of lapis. In that tens and thousands of tons, there's not even a hundred kilos of this quality <laughs> material. I mean, it's all been picked through. Uh, it's not anything that I'm gonna take. It's not anything I do. This is all A grade, double A, triple A grade material. It's all mixed in there. This is all private reserve that I've put back. A lot of this material I've had in my collection for 20 years, right. I've put back. Um, you know, the big thing is when you're designing, and it's kind of like on a lot of different materials that I've gone, uh, gone through in my, in my lifetime. Um, you know, you're, you, uh, as we're bringing in and sorting, I always keep the best for last. Right. I always do that anyway. Um, but with lapis, as I, I would do that, I would set really good quality. I'd still use good quality, but I would, but I would, you know, the best of the best of the material, I would try to keep that back wherever I could. This is an example of how we do it. Now, this is, how, that is how we ship it to the lapidary shop. It goes in those metal containers that I have, and that's me personally picking that. Wow. And that is, the, that material that is being seen right there, this is all A, double A, and uh, and triple A grade material. That was shot a long time ago. I would I would do anything to go back to those days huh? of being able to get that grade of material. You just can't get it. I guarantee you next year, you just wait and see in 2021 mm -hmm. and, and mark my words, we're writing it now. I, our buyer, we had a, we had a <laughs> are you doing those Zoom conferences, Adam? Do you have to do that? Do you do yes. uh, Zoom? Yes, yes. You, you do Zoom. Okay, I gotta tell you, I'm 
I'm so bad at it, right? <laughs> they were they even make fun of me and stuff. Cause I'm not tech I'm I'm not a techie. I'm old. I'm 64. I'm old. I don't do techie stuff. I mean, I'm I'm not a techie person, you know. I know people uh, you know, like my wife is very technical. I mean, she's she she does that. I don't do that. I don't do that. I you know, it's not my thing. So they kid me, they tease me because I can't do this. They have to tell me. It's like talking to a first grader. I mean, <laughs> actually, a first grader could probably do it better than me, to be honest you with you. You have other talents, I, Jay, I, other skills. You know, so I tell you, when, you know when, when I have problems with a computer, I show my grandchild. I mean, you know, Alfie, he'll, he'll literally say, oh, geez, you know, he figures it out like 10 seconds. I'm, you know, I've been looking at it for two hours. But I'm just telling you right now that uh, with... Uh, we have the Zoom conference, and, and Mandy, you know, the buyer, she said, you know, Jay, I don't, I don't see any lapis. You know, we had one, we had one item that we ever laid out for the show. Because, you know, you, you do, we do like 150, 160 designs, right, right that right. you're looking at at any given time. There was one piece of lapis. So if you think I'm messing around, if you think I'm kidding, I'm not kidding. If you want it, Mark my words, okay? You better get on it, okay? We will have some necklaces. It's gonna be few and far between, and it's as we get down to the last of last material. This right here, to tell you the truth, I thought this was pretty cool. I designed this, and I, you know, I had all these shapes that were like the, these long slivers like this, almost like crystals. Yeah. And um, I thought, you know, th there were buckets of these, um, and I thought, you know, Wow, what are you going to do with that? I, if I cut it into cabs, I could only cut it into really small, small cabs. Yeah. Um, I couldn't cut it because of the way they're shaped. It would be hard to cut a rondelle bead. I would waste so much of it. Sure. So I thought, how can I do this to make something new and different, something really totally awesome and cool that looks very natural? You know, it's kind of, it's almost like they look like lapis crystals is what they look like. Um, but their lapis, they, you know, they were naturally shaped like this. And I just, I just took them, I hand faceted them to kind of do these freeform facets. I did a graduated design, lays very nicely. Here again, the quality of the material is just to die for. It's all minimum A grade. There is double A grade material in there, and there's also triple A grade material in there. But there's nothing lower than an A grade in the in the in the actual lapis material rough that we're using in any of that. This is really just something unique, different. If you ask me to repeat on that, um, like I said, if they said if you don't repeat this, Jay, if you don't do this again, yeah. then you'll never work in this town. Then you and I'd be, be I would be living in another city. It's been okay? nice knowing I, you. I would be in this town. Yeah, I mean, this is something that you know. It's like that. Uh, it's like that trick, you know, that magician that you ever heard. He had this trick where he came up. He says, "Okay, watch this trick," and he uh, uh, took a, a a little jar, a little glass, yeah. uh, filled with gasoline, and he drank it. And then he said, "Okay, watch this," and he lit it, and it blew up, right? <laughs> right. And because it was the greatest trick in the world, <laughs> but the problem was he couldn't repeat it, right? <laughs> Never could do it a second time. That was a one and done. And I guess that's my, my way of trying to tell you that this is a one and done. Okay, you're not going to see it again. I'm not going to do it again. Couldn't do it again. Wouldn't do it again. So, you know, like things like this, and you're going to see all the lapis necklaces. I'm trying to do contemporary designs. I'm trying to do styles that people, for the last of the last of the material, yeah. at least when you get it, you're going to have something that you can hand down. It really is going to be a family heirloom. It well, really will be. Th th there's a lot to get to, guys, and we're, we're excited to see the response. 500 sold, about 500 now remain before it's completely reserved. Sometimes I know it can be overwhelming because there's so many pieces of jewelry, great pieces. You know, in the last hour, we had the launch of our golden brown sapphire necklace to much fanfare. That was a huge, huge hit. That was that one particular necklace in the last hour that you certainly should get, and we'll show it again in this hour. In this particular final hour of the show, it's this one. Now, I still have great pieces coming up, but the value, the price, the quality, the premier quality that you've got here at this price is what's really unheard of. Now, something, I don't wanna kind of show the, throw the show off the rails, but really fast, I just want you to see this. I just want you to see this because I didn't realize it was next to me. This is coming up. Remember I, I, I said that we've got um, Lion's Mane, this amazing necklace that's coming up and it's this big deal. Guys, if we can just get a very quick shot of this, I want you to see it in real life. It's $427 
It's like you've never seen it. Look, I, it, I hope this is translating on TV the way it is in real life. It is unbelievable. We will do the lion's mane opal necklace next. So we're gonna do it next. It's about five or six minutes away at the most, but I want you to see it so you could be prepared because there's only 200 available. Very, very special, brand new, something spectacular. Okay, with that being said, things of all different price points. Lapis, as Jay said, you can find everywhere. Can you find this quality? We don't think so. Certainly not at these types of values. Jay, blue continues to be the number one color sold in terms of uh, preference around the world. We all love the color blue, right? It's, it's, it seems to have that universal appeal. This blue is that rich, deep, midnight color that just seems to work for everybody and with everything. You know, in... I think what I love with lapis <clears throat> is the fact, um, you know, I, I really, to tell you the truth, I'm really uh, kind of broken over the fact that we're we're not really getting the material. I love working with lapis. Right. You've seen lapis and kind of been a staple in, in my designs for um, not my entire career, but, um, you know, um, <laughs> My lapis connections, my original lapis connections, actually go out uh, to college where I had people uh, in the Peace Corps, right? Really? That were trading in lapis and doing different. Uh, they w did the Peace Corps in Afghanistan wow. um, before all the trouble, before even the Russian trouble. Right. And um, you know that, uh, and you know they they were actually bringing the native art back. That's the first time I ever was introduced to lapis. And uh, some of those same connections over the years and stuff. Now I have different. Um, you know, the, you know, that's kind of lapis. I guess what I'm trying to say is lapis has really been kind of near and dear to me. Right. Um, it's one of the materials that that I have had good connections on, and was one of the very first materials I used. And it, I'm really kind of brokenhearted to see it kind of go by the way. Um, now that being said, you know, you you would, you know, I keep hoping. Okay, well, maybe something will happen, and I'll I'll see it. But this is this has been five years now. This wow. has been going on. Three years, it, I started to get worried. Last year, I started panicking. And that's when I came to the grip that, you know, just work with what you got left. And, you know, if, it, if that's it, then that's it. It's, it's hard for me to let go when, you know, you, when you got things going out the front door and yeah. nothing coming in the back door, right. pretty soon you have an empty cupboard, right? right? And um, my cupboard soon will be empty on this and it, there's nothing I can do about it. Um, but I'm, I'm just telling you right now, lapis, you know, what's really kind of interesting. Do you know, like I specialize in turquoise, right? right? That's, that is, that is my gig, right? I mean, that's what I, that's, that's what I'm known for. That's what we do. We have one of the largest, uh, collections and private collections, and I'm talking commercial. There are people that have lapis museums, just like if you come to my private collection, I've got turquoises. Um, there are people that I know that even have more than I do that really have some things I would love to to uh, be able to get out of their collection. Um, be uh, that they collected, you know, in the 50s, right, in the, in the early 60s. Um, the but I, I as far as commercial bulk, different materials and in, in different kinds of turquoise, I, I I would say that I don't know anybody that has more of a selection than we do. I, I'm not aware of it. There might be somebody out there, but I'm not aware of who they are. Um, so I specialize in it. That being said, lapis, this this lapis right here is rarer or, than any of the turquoises I have mm. because it only comes from that one location. Mm. It comes from that one area in Afghanistan. A turquoise, if you think about it, you find turquoise, I'm, okay, first turquoise in the United States. That's what it was known for. Turquoise, that's where we went. You have it in Mexico. We get it in Chile. Uh, they have deposits in China, but those are, are running out, believe it or not. You're, you're, you're not seeing anything. Mongolia is my really hot go-to place right now, and that's it. So, you know, like, but you can find it in different areas around the world. It's limited, very rare, it's limited, um, but you can find it. Um, but then you've got lapis. Now, you can find lapis like specimen grade um, in Chile. Mm -hmm. I've seen it actually in America. There's lapis, but it's specimens, right? It's not jewelry grade. It's just specimens, you know, that uh, pieces that you can do. There's, you can't make anything with it. All of, all of the jewelry predominantly 
that I'm aware of uh, in lapis, when you see lapis and it's in jewelry and it's this quality, it all comes from the Hindu Kush region of Afghanistan, where it's still mined or was mined, much as it has been being mined for 3,000 years. There's no infrastructure. Uh, all the material uh, uh, comes down on horses, mules, in panniers, wow. or actually in backpacks. Um, it's it that you know th that's one of the things. Th these aren't huge mines, right? They're small deposits. There are big lapis mines in Afghanistan, but it's all commercial grade material right. that they use for tabletops, counters, tiles. They quarry it, right? But it's not this grade. It's not jewelry grade. But with that being said, it's time to wrap it on up. Congratulations to the 1,000 people that have ordered to grab this tonight. I, I, just to reiterate, you know, the Four Flex is open to everybody. We, we're celebrating 25 years with Jay King and Gemfest, but, you know, never forget, even if you had tuned in for the very first minute with us, anybody can take advantage of the Flex Pay. So we'll take the cost, the price on sale, obviously, and spread it over four months. No interest, no fees, no application. You don't need to be part of a club. Um, everybody's welcome. $29.60. 68 cents on any major credit or debit card. We send it out to you so you get it home. You try it on, you look in the mirror, you ask your husband, uh, your boyfriend, everybody, what, you, what they think, and if you love it, you keep it. If you don't, you send it back. And you have till the end of January of next year to make that decision. So lots of time to really go to town and see what you think about it. We know it's special. It was safe for this hour, for this moment, um, at this price point. It's on the right side of 150. It's on the right side of 120. So it really does deliver what we're looking for, which is the creme de la creme at that rock bottom price. So congratulations. Now, what we're gonna do for the rest of this hour is try and squeeze in as much as possible. I know we've got a very brief encore of the Golden Sapphire world launch that we had in the last hour, so we're excited about that. We'll only spend a couple minutes there, but I want you to see it. Coming up next, it's that lion's mane. It's, uh, it's, you've never seen anything like this it. This is precious opal, precious opal. Precious. I'll tell you the story. We precious opal. You, but Jay, no, I'm glad. The voice of Jay, precious opal. It's Jay, I know you don't know this. We already sold. I, I think it was 50 from the mention. I'll get the clarification. Um, get, uh, get $10 off your first single item purchase if you apply for an HSN card. It's 1-800-695-1418. Um, okay, let's do it, guys. Let's do it. It is Precious Opal. It's Lion's Mane. Uh, first time for me. It is an absolute launch uh, in this show. Uh, you're going to see it. I'm going to let Jay jump in. Producer Allison, forgive me, there's a lot going on. Uh, left, 170. Okay, there's 177 left. Based upon the pre-sell, this will be gone in less than five minutes. Um, that on that basis, I'm going to ask Jay to jump straight into it. Lion's mane, opal bead necklace, do the flex pay, makes it affordable, $106.08. There, I'm not going to move it. Look, look closely. Look at the colors, the radiance, the magic that's coming off this. Jay, this is opal like we've never seen before. Okay, you're actually getting a very great shot of it there. I'm impressed. Okay. Thank you, and sir. That just goes you. Okay, but as impressed as I am on this, this, I, I'm telling you, is um, this is um, minuscule to what, when you get home and you open this up, yeah. and you <laughs> see the play of color on this. This is what I call an opportunity buy, okay? This is a total opportunity buy. Um, I could not ever cut this necklace. In fact, the person who cut this necklace, he specializes in precious opal. This is uh, Ethiopian precious opal. It's the best of the best of the best. This is all triple A grade material. It doesn't get any better. The fire in this is phenomenal. Now, that being said, I, what, what happened is um, my, uh, uh, the person who's uh, very close to me, who's the, uh, the number two slot in, uh, who run actually, to, let's be honest with, actually runs my business, okay? You're, you know, we, we have another shot, but you're doing so well on this, I'm gonna leave it with you. That it's just absolutely gorgeous. You're, that you're actually really showing it. It's, it's, it's stunning. And I'm just telling you guys, if you think it's stunning here, this color, and this is lion's mane, this is one of the, the rarest forms, the rarest colors of this precious Ethiopian opal. It is the rarest by, by, by far. They call it lion's mane because of the, the color. 
um, the Ethiopians, uh, that, that's the name that they call it. And it's one of the, the most prized. I'm telling you right now, I, well, for what we're selling to, honestly, guys, go to the Tucson Gem and Jewelry Show, the world's largest uh, gem event in the entire world on planet Earth. See what they sell one strand of this for at wholesale. At wholesale, these strands and this quality can be a thousand, two thousand dollars. I, I bought a strand of lion's mane uh, eight years ago for my wife when when I first got introduced to the Ethiopian precious opal and the and I still the um, my original con uh, I paid three thousand dollars for the strand. It's one of her prized possessions. Um, my my partner in crime, uh, the person who runs my business, she. Um, was able to make this deal in Tucson. Uh, it's a good friend of ours. Um, you know, we're not trying to take advantage of him. This is an opportunity to buy. Why he did what he did, I don't know. I don't know if he needed money for mining. He did this sale to us, and uh, we were able to deliver on this. And, you know, and we, we just have what we have. There's no way to repeat on these. We're, we've got small quantities of several different colors that we're going to be showing, sprinkling into shows for probably the next three or four shows. Um, you know, and then we, we might have a big one in October of next year, just depending on how it all goes. But you could not replace these. There is no way, absolutely no way in heck that you could actually buy this material and cut this material and be able to sell it for this. They wholesale without finish or anything, without without the sterling silver finding. Mm -hmm. uh, normally, uh, they even put gold findings on this. You never even see them with sterling silver. But literally, I'm telling you, go to the Tucson Gem and Jewelry Show. You'll see what I'm talking about. And it's not, you can buy it uh, cheap and everything, but you can't buy this quality. This is all triple A. Uh, he is not making money. I mean, he lost, he lost me on being able to buy it. Okay. It's, it's just amazing. Do not hang up. I, we are I'm counting you. I'm so excited you. people got that. Yeah. I mean, you are going to be, when you open the box, you're oh. just going to be blown away. But I, unfortunately, that's it. There's no way to repeat on that. Absolutely not. You can't. I, try, I really try my best to show everybody, and trust me, it's even better in real life. Guys, stay in the ordering process for yours. Do not hang up. We are counting you in. Um, congratulations. My, oh my, what an amazing buy that was. 30 minutes left with Mr. J. King. What surprises are in store? We will reveal all after this. I'm on a hunt for the things that make life easier. You know, the products you can't live without. It's all about having the right tool for the right job. Come join me every Saturday at 7 a.m. to find out what makes me say, now that's clever. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. Thank you for tuning in tonight. Uh, the whole crew is here. Everybody's here with Gemfest. Uh, Jay's big day is today's special and amazing item saved for just this show. We're going to keep the party uh, rocking and rolling with our next item, brand new again, never before seen. Now we're going to lift our spirits, and boy, do they need lifting with some beautiful colors. Look at this. Uh, this is our multi-gemstone pendant with necklace. I also have earrings to go with it. I have a beautiful elongated ring. We've got green malachite. We've got oval blue lapis. I've got oval turquoise carbachons. I've got a round pink opal in the rope textured frame as well. I've got all of it together. Really exciting design. Um, if you love color, this is certainly gonna to appeal to you. Uh, an eclectic design, something fresh and original, distinctive, unique, really well priced. Jay, I, you know, you look at the palette that you've used here, they work so well together. There's something about this that just makes, it does, it lifts the spirits. You know, this is kind of, uh, um, 
it, it, you would think that I designed this. Um, this is kind of like uh, kind of what I used to design a long, long time ago. It, br it brought back so many memories. We have a younger designer who's just started uh, doing things. When they brought this to me, it, it, I thought, wow, you know, because that looks like something I would have done right. uh, back in the, in the uh, late 70s, early 80s. Uh, very contemporary, very modern. If you see, it's kind of a, it's a modern cross, mm -hmm. but th it's the collage look where um, he's combined uh, genuine Congolese malachite. You've got that beautiful Azure Peaks turquoise, that clear, clear blue, almost like a sleeping uh, beauty blue clarity to it. Um, the lapis here again, all the, you know, A grade, double A uh, material, just beautiful lapis. And then an amazing Australian pink opal. So a multicolored look, just very fun, very substantial, but it really is, it's its kind of, um, uh, it, I, he really did kind of a modern cross. When you really look at it, when you get it, you'll mm. see what I'm talking about. It's kind of like a modern cross uh, kind of concept um, uh, in the silver. Now you don't have the exact points, but you can see it's kind of, it's the theme, the kind of that contemporary thing of a, a cross. And I've done a lot of these designs, of course, the, the way you could tell it was me, mine were like Mondo big. <laughs> I mean, mine, mine uh, I, I used to make uh, these kind of designs crosses where, you know, like um, literally when you walked, when you wore my designs, you walked in a stoop, right? <laughs> they, they, were, they were the size of, they were the size of cowboy belt buckles, all right? I mean, my thing is go big or go home. Uh, of course, you know, now they've scaled it down and they kind of, did. but it, it, I've done this kind of look. It's really just cool. Brand new and exclusive. We love it. The ring getting limited in size 11 and 12. Um, take advantage of the savings, obviously, today with the FlexPay. Something that we want to just quickly highlight that is coming up is going to be our pink sapphire. Oh, is it this one? The pink sapphire and black spinel. Okay, guys, just take a look for a second. You've not seen this all visit long. Uh, this is on clearance. Remember, we talked about what that means. It just means last of the last. I'm just gonna quickly stand up for a second. Look, look at this beautiful, the combo of the colors. The be I love that. The pink sapphire with the black spinel. Doesn't that look sensational? Lowest price ever, $99.98. Earrings are only 39. Look at the earrings. Which are gonna sell out first? The earrings are gonna sell out first, our producer's letting me know. I really like this. Jay, t 10 seconds, G give me the top line notes on this. Okay, well, Pink Sapphire, this comes out of Mozambique. Uh, it's very, it's one of the rarest colors of, of the predominant colors of Sapphire that is probably one of the more highly sought after um, in, in a standard color. Now, you do get pinks. There's, I've seen pinks in um, in different locations in Africa. Uh, I've also seen pink sapphire come out of Brazil, but it's one of the rare, rare colors. Gorgeous. Now, when you go to sapphire mines, there'll be pinks in almost every single mine where they'll have a multitude of colors. Right. But for just to find a deposit that's one color, that's why the golden sapphire is so is, is such an anomaly. It's so so unusual. The same thing with this. This particular deposit is all just pink sapphire. Well, just pink, 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 pinky pink. And then it's the first time I've ever combined it with black spinel. Oh. And I did black spinel. If you look at them, they're little faceted yeah. black yeah. spinels. I did a spacer beads to make the necklace flow we, much we'll, easier. We'll try and this and is get... a it, right. It's spectacular. Right. We'll try and get to it. I think it's at the end of the very end of the show, but we'll, we'll I mean, guys, the things are moving so quickly tonight. I don't even know. Um, we're going to move over this way. It's time for Desert Sunset. Jay was, was regaling us with a beautiful story of sunsets and the imagery, and now it's time to relive that moment. I mentioned, you know, when I look at the show before I come on air, it's always fascinating to see what items have uh, sold before we even get here. This was the strongest in terms of more people had ordered this than any of the other pieces. I have 100 sold. I believe I, well, I know I'm limited. I'll, I'll get the exact number for you shortly. But this is our spectacular turquoise and desert sunset jasper brand new today. There's a lot to see here and there is a tiny price to see as well. It's 
So really exciting value. One fifteen fifty flex pay and the earrings are available as well. They're those stunning pair drop earrings. They're eighty one dollars and change. Jay, I mean you are you are really the the Obi Wan Kenobi of HSN when it comes to jewelry. Tell me why is one? Why is this? Why do you believe this has been such a big seller from the moment it went online at HSN.com? Well, you know what, what I think it, in. Um, you know, I, I don't know exactly, um, but uh, I, will, I will tell you, I think that uh, overall, the reason people are attracted to mine finds is this, is that you see things with us that you just don't see anywhere else. Right. And it's also the art of this. If you look at this piece, you have something, you know, that's a conversation piece. It's yes. big, it's bold. If you look at the, not only the materials, it's not just the materials, it's the quality but it's the design, it's the overall, it's got it all together. And I think that people, you just don't see things like this. I mean, this is craftsmanship at its finest. And these are all done by practice lapidaris from the rough stock, from, from scratch, from mm. the raw materials. So if you look at the design, it's just totally amazing. It's got that beautiful, okay, number one, the desert sunset. Yes. That material is my, mine from a, a friend of ours, Glenn. I mean, he's, um, uh, he's a, a a miner in Australia that we've done business with for years and years. We've become very close friends with him over the years. Um, we have the exclusive on it as far as America. I don't know anybody else that has this material. Um, we were the first there when he first discovered it. It's a form of uh, tiger's eye. It has the same properties. I, I get all of my tiger's eye comes out of Namibia. Mm. And then Glenn has a material site. It's called Tiger Iron that has a lot of the same metallic properties in the chatoyancy. And then this Desert Sunset has uh, those same properties too. So it really does have that cat's eye or chatoyant effect. The coloration is just amazing. And then this Azure Peaks turquoise, you saw before the turquoise necklace in Azure Peaks that came out of my private collection that I was bragging about. <laughs> that was that really like Sleeping Beauty, Robin's Egg Blue, clear, 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 right? This is Azure Peaks turquoise too, but you see, it's the more green material. Mm. It's the material that um, that you know that that was some of the original materials that they bought before they got really down into the mine and they started getting the real high blues. Mm. So it's still a, a, a very unique color of turquoise. It's a, a, a really kind of a unique flavor, a unique texture to it. But this is the material that I kept that I blended back with this for that design. So they're natural designs. Um, but if you think about this, look how well made these are, right? They're, they're incredible. They draw these out. Okay, there is no, there is no machine that cuts these. This is an art form. They literally slice the raw material. If you think about this, they take a template. They once they, on that slice of raw material, whatever they're using, the Desert Sunset, the Azure Peaks, right. they draw out on the template, they draw that design. They take a little diamond Dremel tool and they cut that out. And then they hand finish it. They're individually put together like a piece, like a puzzle right. is how they put it together. It takes literally um, not just hours, in some cases days, to just make one of these. And you know, and that's the art of it. That's being able, that's the art of being able to do this. Look at the finish. Look at the overall quality. You know, even on the, you know, look how tight the gaps are on this. Yeah. And the gaps are three dimensional. They're not flat. Do you see where they actually carve them? So that gives it that three dimensional look. It gives it a better color uh, component when you do it. It also looks so much better and it makes it wear and feel wonderful when you have it on. Isn't that amazing? It's literally wearable art. Where are you gonna see anything else like that? I mean, it just doesn't exist. It really is an art, it's a skill. And you just, uh, you know, it's funny because you look at it and there's no way anybody would match $115 with this necklace. Especially when you look out there in the world today and you see what a lot of the celebrities are wearing, what's in style, what's in vogue. It's all about drama around the neckline. It's all about bigger and bolder, more presence, right? This gives you that presence. And we've seen lots of lovely necklaces tonight, but in terms of 
standout in terms of sizing. This obviously is one of a kind. There's nothing that even touches it. It's big, it's bold, and it really is beautiful. Uh, final three or 400 now available before it's completely reserved. We are uh, three minutes or sell out, whichever happens first. I do want to draw your attention to this. It's part of our today's special. One of the options on our today's special, of course, the Jasper that would go back beautifully to it. If you do want the today's special, it's about $165, and it comes in the three amazing colors. Jay, this looks like it was made for one another. Well, you know, and here again, the rarity of the desert sunset and, you know, the opportunity you have in that, like that cup. And I'm telling everybody, just like I'm, I'm like the Ethiopian opal, okay, with these cups, with the lapis, um, uh, if you can do it, and I'm, I'm not, you know, and I sincerely mean this, don't break the bank, don't get yourself in trouble. I'm not saying that, that would break my heart. But I'm just telling you, if you, if you can afford these designs, um, especially anything in silver right now on the on the cup bracelet. Boy, now's the time to get it, guys. There, it's not going to go down in price. It's only going to go up. It, um, it's it, I don't I don't see it going down. I don't see silver going down with everything that's going on right now. It's just you know I'm I'm concerned about it to tell you the truth. Like I said, right. I'm having to pull designs. I've had to reprice designs for 2021. You know, I'm trying to lock the silver before we, you know, we have to lock the show. The silver's gone up so so much that I have to reprice it. Um, I'm having to pull designs because of the silver and how much silver it has in it. Um, so, you know, I'm just telling you, now's the time. If you can afford it and you see something you like and it's big bold and it's big silver like that, you really might want to consider it. On something like this, you love this on Kent, you know, Kenya. I mean, look at, Gorgeous. this is this is the kind of look that when you walk into a room or people are gonna come up to you. I'm a people watcher. You know, it's really strange. <laughs> you know, guys, you know, like, I, I have friends that are totally oblivious, <laughs> right? I mean, they're totally oblivious um, to um, what, uh, what people are wearing. And not just women, men, as right. far as their jewelry. And what you wear, it says a lot about you. It really does. You know what I mean? I can, I can, I, and sometimes I'm wrong. You know, sometimes I'm wrong. But I got to tell you, I'm right more than I'm wrong. On, on people, it's really funny. Um, you know, uh, you can just uh, by what they wear in their style, you can, you can. It tells a lot about that person. But these are conversation pieces. These are the kind of pieces that when you walk into a room, people are going to come up and go, oh my gosh, yeah. what is that? Where did you get that? But you're going to hear, what is that? I mean, you're going to hear that a lot. Um, and I think that that, I mean, that's why you buy jewelry. That's why you get accessories. I mean, you know, I, I have things that I make for myself that friends have made for me, things that I wear. They're very personal to me. But I can't tell you how good it makes me feel. And people come up to me all the time, or even on the show, a lot of times people call in and say, can I get that cup? Can I get that? Can I get that? Where would we buy that? Well, no, you, you can't, you know, you don't. And so I think that that's really, um, you know, that's, that's why you have things like this. Um, again, all handcrafted. Think about the craftsmanship that goes into this. Think about all the work mm. that goes into this, the skill. And these are all natural materials. And you've got Azure Peaks turquoise here, blended it back with that beautiful um, desert sunset. And this is, um, this is from the outback in Australia. And it is a form of tiger's eye. It's, it's, it's a, a jasper, but it has its chatoyant. Mm. So it has that thing, that gleam. And don't forget the earrings. The, the earrings are $81.60 and worth every penny. Again, as a collection, as a suite of jewelry, it looks beautiful together. The necklace, as you can see, is on fire. It's, it's $115, so $115. You just get so much for so little on this. Um, incomparable, uncomparable to anything we've seen, certainly tonight, the today's special, going back with it. Certainly spectacular in the uh, uh, Jasper that you've got there. Again, with all the sterling silver workmanship that's there. So again, thank you for all of your orders on this. Try it and get it home. There's only so much that we can do with only so many minutes in each presentation, but the real test is when you wear it. The lovely Kenya doing an awesome job tonight, looking a million dollars in every single piece. This one in terms of the length is also great, very versatile because it's 18 and a half inches up to two and th uh, with another two and three quarter inch extender. So you've got lots of opportunity. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your orders on this one. Okay. 
Jay, you and me, as we normally do, we've caused a stir, my friend. We showed, we showed the um, pink sapphire. Oh, gosh, I've got so many pieces here. What's that? We showed the pink sapphire. Over 300 were pre-ordered. Okay, there's 900 left. So we sold we sold 300, there's 900 left. It's a clearance deal. This was supposed to be right at the end of the hour. Um, obviously, you can see it's not gonna make it till the end of the hour. We're gonna sell this out in the next few minutes as well. Real sapphire, pink sapphire, pink sapphire with, as Jay mentioned, for the first time, he's including the black spinel. So you get the, I'm gonna take it off, hold on real fast. Again, guys, run to the phone if you wanna get this one. Lowest price ever, not returning, $99.98. The earrings are only $39.98, which is just crazy. Um, Jay, earlier we launched Golden Sapphire, and our good friends at home might be able to see that again before the end of the show, but Sapphire in beautiful colors has really taken off. We're starting to appreciate some of the spectacular colors that Sapphire can come in. How important is it that this is pink Sapphire? Well, you know, the pink and the... <clears throat> Uh, like I said before, when I was selling the Golden Sapphire, I was telling the story of, you know, like, um, I've only been in the Sapphire business for a little over three and a half years. Uh, it's not that in 44 years I haven't seen Sapphire, of course. It's, I've, you know, I've, um, it, it's in very different, lo in various locations throughout the world where I, I did a lot of business, and I just never could afford it. I never, I didn't have the proper connections. Um, even though I was in the area, I didn't really, you know, have the mining connections. Uh, there was a lot of things. I didn't have the money. I didn't have the money to really buy the way that I can buy now and be able to, to get the kind of deals that right. I get. And uh, also, you know, I didn't have, I didn't have the, the power that I have with the mine finds here where I, I, I can market directly to our viewers, right? Um, so <clears throat> I really kind of uh, stayed away from uh, Sapphire. It was mainly for cost reasons. Right. Uh, three and a half years ago, uh, I made my first Sapphire purchase. Um, because of that, it would have just took <laughs> off because of the volume that I bought and everything. I Now I'm meeting all these Sapphire miners. That's how I got the golden Sapphire. Pink Sapphire, same thing. Uh, the In Mozambique, um, he came to me, th and this guy is like the Sapphire Kahuna, okay? <laughs> <laughs> he's, Mr. he's Mr. Sapphire Kahuna. I mean, this guy is... He is connected, and he's uh, connected me with a lot of a lot of different people. Pink, though, is one of the hot, hot colors. Yeah, it, a natural pink is one of the hot, hot colors in sapphire. One of the most desirable is the pink. Uh, as far as you you do find pink, it's usually very, very expensive. But now, when you see pink sapphire in a lot of deposits, absolutely, you might have one bead. 10 beads right, that you can make with the pink. But you'll have greens and you'll have blues and you'll have yellows and I mean, you'll have everything. You won't have the gold, okay? But you'll have all the colors of the rainbow. But uh, but it's predominantly, uh, the only mines that really you see a lot in Sapphire is the blue, like the, the indigo blues, the, yeah. the uh, deep blues. Uh, you see a lot of Sapphires where that color. Pinks, if it's red, if it's one of the four colors of red, it's ruby, right? In, in, is what, you know, the current of the uh, sapphire is, if it's one of four colors that GIA accepts, then it's classified as ruby. Right. Otherwise, it's sapphire. So any of the uh, any other color besides those four, four colors of red are uh, ruby, and anything else, any of the other colors are classified as sapphire. Uh, so if you didn't know that. Jay, the, the, the quantity count is ticking down r rapidly. Guys, this is where you've got to have an eagle eye spread throughout the show. I think we've done three clearance deals. This is the third and final clearance deal, marking the end of Jay's big today special visit. Uh, I have over 400 people ordering right now, which is about 300. The earrings are selling pretty evenly with the necklace at this stage. Um, Okay, dead even, I'm being told right now. Dead even, which simply means that everybody that's buying the necklace is buying the earrings to go along with it. Um, the drop earrings, beautiful. Jay, having the black spinel in there gives it a whole different character. It gives it some more attitude, don't you think? Well, I, I appreciate you saying that, Adam, because I thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was you, Jay. <laughs> you know what's really funny? Uh, but 
only if you love it that I, I would. Otherwise, I wouldn't have taken credit. I mean, that's just how I roll, Adam. That's you just how I roll, silent. right? <laughs> I know I, that's how I stay married to a British woman. That's how I roll, baby. Clever that's man. how I roll. Clever man. And, and, I, and I, you, you know, you know, you know the deal, right? So, um, but um, I did that. Actually, I did it for color, you know, for color contrast with the pink. But I also did it. I faceted the spinel, so I did it for bling. But not only that, I did it to when you wear it, it acts as a rotation as a spacer bead. So it actually makes it wear, it, it's like a pivot point. And the black spinel is so hard that it's, it's almost the hardness of, of uh, it's, it's a, a, almost as hard as sapphire or so diamond. So you don't have to worry about it chipping or breaking. Right. So uh, you, get, you get the bling from the black spinels because it's fasted. You get the bling from the pink, uh, pink sapphire because it's faceted. And so then you ha you've got the color contrast of that hot pink and that dark, dark, dark uh, midnight black from the black spinel from Thailand. And then you put it all together and then it lays beautifully. Stay so, right there. And then on top of that, they give some stupid price. <laughs> I mean, just some giveaway price. I mean, just crazy. You got all the best ingredients of the world. It's the perfect recipe right there, the recipe for success. Thank you for your orders on that. Um, before we say goodbye tonight, uh, a few things. For, first, I want to recap. The lapis from this hour. Oh, my gosh. If you missed the lapis, it was the one item of this hour that absolutely everybody should buy. 118 and change. A necklace, again, that Jay designed premium quality lapis is hard to find at $118 a mega buy and of course in the last hour the world launch happened right here the excitement was in the air you could feel it this was golden sapphire real fast you can see the magnificence magnificence of golden brown sapphire jewelry cocos uh, uh, cashmere's golds the color was extraordinary I have our final quantities available if you would like to order the necklace and the earrings are available on that golden brown sapphire. Um, the lovely Leslie and Machado is going to give us a sneak peek at what's coming up at midnight. And then we'll round out our final 10 minutes with Mr. Jay King with a very brief look at his best buy of the day. Stay with us. Hey, Leslie. Oh, hi, Adam. I don't know if it's possible to geek out over a kitchen appliance, but here it is, sold out before we even got it on air, the Ninja Foodie 8-in-1 Sheet Pan Air Fryer. That's right, this guy does eight functions all on your countertop. Yes, it air fries, air, air fries roasts and broils and bakes, dehydrates, keeps warm, toasts your bread, and then when it's not in use, watch this, you guys, boom flips up so that extra large capacity becomes countertop space when it's not in use. It is a genius product. We couldn't keep it in stock. It's the launch tonight, and we've got a very special price, even better than the Ninja Foodie website. So if you eat, if you love to cook, if you love practicality, and you love your counter space, you gotta join me tonight. Don't go anywhere. I'll see you in about seven minutes. Thank you, Leslie. That's so clever. I didn't know it did that. That's amazing. Um, just a few moments away before Leslie launches it. Before we do end with Jay, I do want everyone to see his today's special. Marking 25 years and our Gemfest extravaganza, just 60 seconds on the clock. Uh, we are down to the bare bones of what now remains. One color is already sold out. The three colors are here. More silver than we've ever seen in the past. Jay, a 60 second roundup. The three colors are amazing. Um, how do you put it into words? I know this is a very important today's special. Okay, I'm, I'm just telling you that on, on this, if you could swing it, uh, don't you, don't let, don't let this, the last few remaining that we have, don't let them pass you by. This, um, I worked really hard on this to give you a big, bold presence in sterling silver, and I guarantee you, the price is only gonna go up. Yeah. You're not gonna ever see this go down. The price goes up in five minutes, five and a half minutes. So please grab it. 28 by 28 uh, millimeter stone in the center, beautifully faceted. It's gorgeous. Thank you for your orders on our today's special. You can see more online if you'd like to see more. Um, because we've sold out of so much of the show, we're going to end our spectacular finale with Jay with, of course, the world launch that we had about 60 short minutes ago. And that was this. 
golden sapphire. Few remain, but if you missed it, I do want you to certainly take in the glory of amazing sapphire in a color that we simply have not seen before. Guys, this looks magical because it really does appear magical to the naked eye. Look at the size of this phenomenal sapphire necklace. Guys, look at the colors. I have four minutes or sell out. Uh, cashmere, cocoa, golds, uh, platinums in there. I mean, it just, it, 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 it ignites the senses. It really does, it smolders. For fall and winter, this is something I think you're gonna get a real kick out of wearing. Jay, we've never seen anything quite like it. Give us the potted history, as it were, on the launch of our golden brown sapphire. Okay, this is a, this is a material that even, you know, even the, um, uh, the GIA uh, person who looked at this had never seen this color mm. in sapphire before. Um, we, I had never, like I said, they were saying it was sapphire in the field. I mean, it was sold to us as, as sapphire. Um, and, uh, you know, everything that we do, we always get it tested. It field tests as sapphire. It has the hardness of sapphire. I mean, the only way to really do it is run it under electron spectrometer, all kinds of really, um, you know, high-tech tests to tell you, you know, to guarantee you that that's what it is. And we did this from the rough. I will tell Incredible. you, it is the most un unique, unusual color in sapphires. And here again, I'm not professing myself as um, the, uh, you know, the sa uh, sapphire expert. Uh, I learn something new about sapphires on a daily basis almost. Uh, I only got into the sapphire business really seriously about, it's been about three and a half years now. Uh, these are the things that are exciting me. I mean, it's even exciting people <laughs> in the sapphire industry. <laughs> in this color. I mean, people that have been doing this for their whole life and they've never seen this color. So I, I th that's what really excites me too, because when I tell them, you know, that this, they go, that, you know, you can't, that doesn't exist. Well, yes, it does, you know? So, um, but this comes from Guinea. And if you've ever been to Guinea, I mean, they're not known for mining, guys, okay? It's not, it's not a mining country, right? They're known for a lot, of, a lot of things, but they're not known for mining, okay? So uh, it really is, it's a unique material. It's a brand new mine find, which is, I mean, I mean, it's got everything in the world that makes me happy, right? I mean, to go out, to you discover something that's brand spanking new, nobody's ever seen it before, brand new mine find, first time you can launch it, you're able to work it, and also, this is the largest sapphire necklace I've ever made. The the crystals in this, do you realize these are all, you know, sapphires are crystals, right? They're right. just, you know, they're natural crystals. And that's what you cut them from. You cut them from the crystals. And um, so to be able to get crystals that were this big, to be able to cut this material that, you know, that are this size, it's really, really amazing. I mean, if you, you, if you can imagine, you know, anytime you, you cut something, you have to have something bigger than that to cut it, right? right? I mean, you, you can't take things that are smaller and make them big. It right. just doesn't work. <laughs> you can take big things and make them smaller, but you, it doesn't work the other way around. But I mean, this has weight to it. Another thing too is sapphire. It's very dense. The molecular structure of sapphire is very, very dense. That's what makes it so hard. And that's what makes it polish so well. And that's what makes it cut so well. Um, and that what is what makes it facet so well is the hardness of the material. But here again, if you like new and you like unique and you like unusual, and here again, I'm not saying that down the road I might be able to get this material. Right now, I can't. I, don't, right. I used everything. This was a one and done as far as this particular purchase. I bought the rough. I made this necklace. That was it. We made literally a, a, about half of what, what they wanted. Well, Jay King, as being, always, uh, I did, <laughs> <laughs> as always, a pleasure to be with you, sir. Do you have a show tomorrow? We got, uh, I've got two shows tomorrow and two shows Sunday. I'm wrapping it up. I started with Suzanne Runyon. I'm gonna wrap it up with Suzanne on Sunday. And then you're not gonna see me for a while, okay? I promise. No, we <laughs> love it when you're here, Jay. It doesn't feel right when you're not here. We're sending you all of no. our best, my friend. Congratulations on a wonderful day. 25 amazing years with Jay King. We love him and we love you for watching. Thank you for being a part of our show. Stay in the ordering process for your golden sapphire and see everything else online at hsn.com. I'll be back with you tomorrow night at midnight for a new Amazon Fire Today special. Feeling hungry, though, with a new Today special launching right here, right now. Good night, everybody. Bye.
love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone to see our Gemstone Enhancement Chart. It is a new day at HSN. Welcome in. My name is Leslie, and we've got one of the hottest brands in kitchen appliances and their latest in innovation, an eight-in-one. Yes, air fryer first and foremost, but does eight separate functions, and when you don't use it, whoops, flips back up, so extra large capacity, but still small footprint on your countertop. We've got a phenomenal price. We've got FlexPay extended holiday returns. Take a look today. If you eat, if you love food, here's our best value.